Hello everybody, it's Sai Custis Gaming here, bringing you with another awesome video. Now today, we're here back in Minecraft. I'm doing another little tutorial, I guess. Now, cake. We all love cake. Minecraft cake, chocolate cake, cheesecake, regular cake, strawberry shortcake, and much more. We all love this delicious little piece, or whole cake, or a freaking tower of cake. Yes, we do. We love cake. Now, <laughs> all you're going to need for this little build, for this little hilarious build, is you're going to need brown wool, white wool, and red wool. And brown wool is probably the hardest thing you're going to get because you need to have a jungle. So you can have cocoa beans and to make brown dye and then brown wool, I don't know, or just dye a sheep brown, bring it back with you. White wool, just get any white sheep. I mean, seriously, the world's mostly consisted of white sheep. I mean, I could probably look around. White sheep, see. And red wool, just get yourself a rose or a poppy or some kind of red flower. It's going to work. So what you want to do is you want to start off by making an 8x8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. An 8x8 eight eight of brown wool. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Did I get that right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Wait, hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 8. All right. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. All right. So now that you have that, that's your little outline for this, and you can go ahead and just get rid of this floor. You really don't need the grass here. You can keep it if you want, but if you're even going to use it for something. Me, I have no use for it. So, I'm just going to... Ah, I don't know. I do want to put this in my survival world, though. Not accelerated, but normal size amazing world, because this is freaking adorable looking so you want to just do this and come on let's fill this up this only took me about 10 minutes in creative so once you get the materials you're pretty much good all right so now you're just going to build up a second layer of brown wool oh nope not that not yet Now, what you could do is you could just make it solid brown or solid white for the third one. I, what I did was I just went ahead and made it brown and white while mixing it together sometimes. So, I'm going to do that yet again. And we're just going to keep it like this, nice and simple. So we're going to then fill in white between all the brown spaces, which that sounds absolutely wrong. But, yeah. It's, it's what we got to do. Alright, now that you have that, just go ahead and put one more layer of white on top of all of that layer. And then, come on, come on, game, don't be lagging on me just because I have face cam, which I haven't had in a while, but I'm thinking, it's time, it's been a while. So now what you want to do is you just want to take your brown wool and place one right there and one on top, delete the one on bottom, and outline this thing. Oop. Um. Dang it. <laughs> All right, and now you just want to go ahead and repeat what we just did. Make a second layer of brown. Do not need that brown right there on the bottom. And then randomly place it or make it solid. Your choice, not mine. All right, and then you want to go ahead, fill up all this space that we have. 
in how many? Ah, that's how many. Okay. Well, then what you want to do is you want to place one more layer of white. Literally, literally just keep on stacking. You can make this bigger if you want it to be. Just make sure the width and length of it is even. Okay, and then you're just going to do the same thing. Is You're going to pile up one more time. And then you're going to add a second layer. And then I'm going to go ahead and just place these things like this. With a two space in between. Pile up on the white. And actually, I could go one more. Should I? Yeah, let's just do it. And then... Well, I don't know. How does this look? Yeah, that looks absolutely ridiculous ridiculous with that one on top. So we're going to have to move it down by one. And maybe put a berry in between these. No, that top one just looks so ridiculous. I can't, I just can't do it. All right. <laughs> Looks like we have some lighting issues down here. Very spooky. Very spooky. Now just fill this off because really, this is creative. We don't have any real purpose for it. And then just randomly place red wool around this on the top of the white. Okay, and that should be it. And that is how you make a cake tower. That actually does look delicious. If it was in real life, I would be eating it right now. If that was edible in Minecraft, I would be eating it right now. But that looks absolutely delicious. Hope you guys did enjoy. Remember to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And comment. Sorry, I kind of just got into the food thing today. Because I've been watching a whole bunch of food videos, which is why I wasn't on yesterday. So, yeah. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!